Hey guys, welcome to another Block Spotlight and today yet another engine we're going to be looking at the biogas engine this one's from Forestry and uh, it's a little bit different to some of the other ones um, particularly the combustion engine the combustion engine you need to make sure you're keeping cool the biogas engine won't actually work unless it's warmed up so slightly different mechanic um, the biogas engine won't ever explode though that's the difference between that and the combustion engine and the recipe for this guy is over here bronze gears and bronze bars in your standard Billcraft engine uh, layout which I'm sure you're getting very used to from all the uh, other engines we've looked at already now the biogas engine is actually one of the more flexible engines that are around the only thing that you're actually going to need for it and even then that's kind of debatable uh, is the lava to warm it up now it is possible to warm it up with another engine like a steam engine um, but you would probably want to end up just putting some lava in there if you can. Now the fuel that you can use these on is there's, there's quite a few different ones which you can see I've got set up several different um, fuels so you can see see it working. Uh, we have water. Now you can actually run a biogas engine on water it is going to use up a lot more lava it's going to use lava c consistently when you're powering it on water and water is going to last a thousand ticks per bucket which isn't a huge amount compared to some of the other um, consumption rates of the other fuels but um, actually it will uh, generate the same output as a steam engine so same as one of those now the other thing that you can power it on is milk now milk won't use lava at a consistent rate it will only use lava to warm the engine up once the engine's warm up warmed up it won't use any more lava until you stop the engine again um, the milk again same output as a steam engine but this time it will last 40,000 ticks which is quite a bit longer I mean it's 40 times longer than the water will last um, so you get quite a bit of power for a bucket of milk but it is only the same as a steam engine so it's actually uh, a pretty viable early game way of powering some of your your farms and machines and things because you can reuse that engine later on on some of the other fuels and actually increase the output of the engine by just changing the fuel you're putting into it now something else you can use in a biogas engine is seed oil now seed oil its output is three times the milk so it's the equivalent of three steam engines and that's going to last for 10,000 ticks which is a quarter of the length of time the milk lasts but you're getting three times as much power out of it um, then you've got apple juice which is the same output as the seed oil I think that's right anyway I will check that and uh, put some comment up if it's wrong. Pretty sure the apple juice is the same. In fact, we can maybe check a little bit. Should be the same output. See, that's not really telling me much useful. Same output as the, the seed oil. You can also use biomass. Now, biomass will give you the same output as a combustion engine so that's five microwave joules per tick 
Um, the difference being is that obviously the biogas engine won't explode and the combustion engine will and also biomass is a lot easier to get your hands on than fuel is for the combustion engine so biomass is definitely the way to go and then you've got honey now honey will output the same power as a steam engine and again it's going to last 10,000 ticks so the honey, the juice and the seed oil all outputting the same which is identical to a actually not the seed oil the honey and the apple juice is outputting one megajoule a tick minecraft joule per tick for 10,000 ticks same as a steam engine uh, and that's the different fuels you've got for the biogas engine so it's really quite versatile and quite flexible it, you can basically put into it whatever you've got extra of and it will cope with it which is pretty cool there's not many engines you can say that about the only thing you do need with it is lava so once again the end of another spotlight uh, if you guys have got any comments for me please put them below uh, make sure you're following me on twitch as well again streaming every night 7 o'clock BST uh, and I will see you guys next time thanks for watching